welcome back for another vlog so today I don't have much planned today's my actually my husband's day off so he'll be hanging out at home with us today I think he's gotta um mow the lawn out back but that's about it I don't think we have much going on today so I'll just take you guys along so for the past two days we I haven't vlogged anything you probably won't be able to tell because I was good on videos but we were just trying to recover from our trip because we did a lot of walking and uh especially in the heat so we were tired we were very tired and yesterday i got some cleaning done upstairs and stuff like that and i cooked and that was about it but i'm going to go ahead and um vlog today so i will take you guys along with that also i forgot to mention that this weekend is father's day so i feel like every weekend i have something going on either birthdays I had birthdays back to back y'all I'm getting tired and now Father's Day is this um, Sunday as well so I normally my husband likes steak and potatoes type of dinner for Father's Day but he's getting two teeth pulled on Friday so he's he's gonna have more of a soup type of meal for Father's Day so I'm trying to figure out what to make that will be good for him to eat so I, I have to figure it out plus I want to make some dessert as well but as far as gift goes my husband is just like me we don't really care too much for gifts but he has everything he's a huge cologne collector I'm, I'm gonna see if I can show you guys his collection he, he has pretty much hundreds of cologne so he has that so it's not much he has every tool that he can think of that's why our garage looks the way it does because it's full of tools he uses them all but it's full of tools so he has all of them it's like I don't know what to get him so I went on Amazon and just got him a make sure he ain't around I just got him another cologne that he doesn't have on there like he loves cologne like and let me tell you my husband is one of the best smelling men out there like you can pass him and he just smells good like women love to say oh my god what do you got going on and I'm okay with that he does smell good <laughs> so let me show you his collection all right y'all so my husband has oils he has a bunch of cologne and then we move down and there's a bunch of them here and he uses all of them not all I want of course so there's more this is one of my favorites right here but um, he has a lot. Let me leave it away. Let me see. It was one here that's so, like I re I love them all, honestly. Which one is this one? I don't know. It doesn't have a name. But um, look, there's another row. These are all cologne that he has. And they all smell good, especially this one. I really like this one as well. It's um, one of my favorites that he's wear that he wears is the 212. Oh, this one also smells really good. I mean, they all smell good. This is the Burberry Touch for Men. Um, it's a 212, and I think he just ran out of that one, so I probably got that on my list. This one is also another one that he um, wears. It just smells so good. But pretty much most cologne he has them. But it's a few that he doesn't have that's it's come out so. I found one that he actually doesn't have. I made sure to look in here first. Oh, this one also smells good too. This is the Abercrombie and Fitch. This one smells great. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But yeah, that's what I got him. Alright, y'all. So I'm getting ready to water my flowers. And you would think I do not water her, but guess what? I water her every single day. And she likes to throw a fit. Like every single time. If I don't water her on time every single day, she throws a fit and then she'll end up looking dead she does this to me every day I'm gonna clean her up and I'm gonna water her and then I'm gonna show you a few hours later what she looks like I swear she's faking
watching movies in here so my living room looks a little toe up from the flow up but that's okay i'm about to get this um back straight again right back straight everything looks good now so I'm in Destiny's room now because she wants to play <laughs> I told her to put play clothes on and this is what she get she gets out her closet that's okay though Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm Hi, welcome to Destiny's Cafe. Destiny's Cafe. What are you serving your cafe? Mm, yeah. Cheesy pizza. I have some eggs, sardines. You got eggs and what? Sardines. Deans? Sardines. Sardines. Okay. Cheese. Eat pizza. Cheese. Sardines. Watermelon, mm. crackers, okay, eggs, oranges, and what is this called again? Missy, eggplant. Eggplant. Um, I'll find you a seat. Okay, thank you. Your seat will be right here. Oh, okay. So that'll be your bed. This is my table. Yep. Alrighty. You can also use that too. Okay. Okay, is this my menu? Uh, no, I, this is my, I'm making a menu. Oh, okay, I gotta see what, I'm, what you have on the menu first. All right. We Are you making one? Yep. What kind of bread is this? Do we have olive oil in? And stuff? Olive oil? Here's the mm. olive oil. Here's olive oil and I'll get Catch olive oil? Where I put olive oil, you guys. <laughs> olive oil in there and I'll get I like dipping my bread in olive oil. Especially when they crack, we, they use herbs and, and pepper. Oh, and cheese for bread. Okay, I like that. I'm gonna just some olive oil all over it. Alright. What do you eat? Huh? What do you eat? You can eat that. Okay. Destiny made a menu, so she got a cheese piece, cheese pizza, like together. Yep. Cheese pizza, eggs, tuna fish, sardines, sardines and tomato sauce. I mean, in sardines tomato? and tomato sauce, okay. crackers, egg, plant, orange slice. Mm, that's a delicious menu. What if I want pepperoni pizza instead? Hmm. Do you have pepperoni pizza? Okay. <laughs> I just like being difficult. But you have to get the drinks first, so I gotta write the drinks. Okay. So we have. What do we have for drinks? We have. Let's see. We have tea. Okay. Coffee. Okay, that's good. Hmm. Juice, like. Oh, we have water. Yes, we definitely need water. We have lemonade. Okay, I love lemonade. Do you have strawberry lemonade? That's my favorite. Yep. Good to know. Straw. We also have sodas. We do? 
We have Pepsi. Okay. Coke, Coke, Coca-Cola. <laughs> Coca-Cola. <laughs> Say it. <laughs> Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Okay, hold on. Let me look at the menu. Okay, are you ready to write to get to get my order? Yep, I'm giving you some money so you can pay for stuff. Oh wow, aren't you so generous? Okay. Oh, that's a lot of dollars. <laughs> okay, can I get a cheese pizza? All right. With. Pepperoni added to it. Mm -hmm. Can I get red onions on it too as well? Yeah, there we can put all the vegetables if you want. Well, I would like um, bell peppers mm -hmm. on there with some red onions and cut up tomatoes on there. Okay, and some pepperoni. Mm -hmm. And can I get what's this? Crackers. Crackers. Can I get some crackers? Mm -hmm. All right. Can I get a salad on the side? I like salad with my pizza. And for a drink. Can I get a strawberry lemonade? All right, that'll be all. All right. Thank you. That down. <laughs> yeah, is that the pizza? Yep. Yeah, put it on a plate. A side salad? Yep. We don't have salad on there, but we, I forgot, but I'll put it on. What kind of restaurant is this? How come you ain't got no salad? We have salad. You have sweet tea? Yep. Can I get some sweet tea? Alright. You want sweet tea and lemon? Yes, I want both. Alright. <laughs> you guys, she has me hostage. She won't let me go. <laughs> I got things to do. Man, that order is really taking a long time. I wonder what's taking so long. But I need to try to do something. Huh? I never mind. <laughs> I'm getting hungry here. Here you go. What's this? The drinks. Okay. Salad. I shred that up. Where's the salad? Until I can shred this up. Oh, yeah, shred the eggplant? And then I put a fruit in there. This is the salad? Is, yep. And here's your this crackers. This is the salad. Here's your crackers. <laughs> okay. My crackers? Where's my pizza? Pizza. And here you go. I can carry all of it at once. Okay. You got a lot of food, ma'am. What are you trying to say? You ordered a lot. Mmm. <laughs> oh, this piece is cold. Mommy, it is cold. <laughs> I warmed it up. Well, I cooked it and I put the toppings on there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay, let me see. Is it warm enough? It's warm enough, but it looks like I can eat some salt. Okay. Mm, it tastes a little better. Pepper <laughs> salt or some what? Ketchup. You forgot the peppers on my pizza. I put peppers. <laughs> Let me try the salad. Pepper. The peppers are. Okay, I'm gonna eat, try the salad. See if it tastes good. It's good. I mean, it's okay. I put crackers in there too. You put crackers Cracker in shreds. my salad. You put crackers in my salad? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me try the crackers. Are these made by you? Yep. Okay, I like the crackers. Mm, mm. This this tea has no sugar in it. No, I put sugar in it. Kind of like it's good. I asked for sweet tea. I put sweet tea in there, Mom. That's true. <laughs> So we decided to leave out of the house real quick. Um, we're going to take my car first to the car wash so it could get some love and get a good wash. And then I'll, I won't say anything now because the kids are in the car, but I'll take them somewhere to get something real quick. Mm -hmm. Wait for yours.
No, mine's is last, I think. No, they're doing the red one. Oh, okay. Is it good? Yep. This is my second time having pelicans this year. Oh, yeah? I'm about to have mine now. And I tell y'all, she was just throwing a fit, looking all sad and pitiful, but she is back to her normal self. All right, y'all, so I just finished warming up the barbecue chicken from yesterday. And then since we didn't have any size, Destiny wanted for me to make her cheesy potatoes, which is what she likes. It has bacon in it, and it's like the red potatoes. So that's what we, what we will be having as a side for dinner. So I really didn't really, didn't really have to cook today. Can I just tell y'all how handy this thing is, like, I was um, adding some salt to the potatoes and I just love it. I love it so much. You guys are awesome, honestly. But um, it was de it's definitely gonna help my wrist, that's for sure. It's been pretty a chill day. We went and washed the car and everything and came right back home. I did do, I did do the kids' laundry and then when we came home, my husband made us all sandwiches because we were starving after the ice thing. Because it's really, they're like shaved ice, but it's basically water. So. We were all starving, so we had that, and then my husband took a nap. The kids are upstairs nice and quiet. So we haven't really much, done much today. Um, so hopefully later on after dinner, we could probably play a board game. That would be fun. It's before, but um, throughout the summer, I do have the kids doing schoolwork. So right now, they use Epic, which is like a reading app that has all the books on there. So every day they do 20 minutes, and usually I check that on my phone, make sure they do the 20 minutes. And then they also do Adventure Academy app. It's kind of like ABC Mouse, just for older kids. And they do 30 minutes of that every single day. Now, Destiny, Lord have mercy. Destiny is a little behind on her math. So she's going to the third grade. So right now I want to work more on her second grade math before I get into the third grade math. So I went on education.com it lets you print out three free worksheets every day so um we'll start working on math soon so i got this one out let me see i got this one like she is amazing at reading she's actually at um sixth grade level level reading and it has a lot to do with the fact that the boys the books that the boys read she reads as well but her math is a little low so we're gonna be working on money as well um this is more of a like story type thing on here but most of it that i have to work on with her is math so like telling time which she's very good at when it comes to this um telling time and then just you know two digit numbers and then we're going to move over to the three digit numbers as far as um math goes so like that she start off with a year a lot better than we did last year. I swear to y'all, when the pandemic ha happened, that last half of the school year when she was in first grade, it didn't go so well. We hardly learned anything and we barely made it. And then she was, she went into second grade, started off with virtual learning, didn't learn anything hardly at all. So I, as far as math goes, cause it was easy to have her reading. It's just math that we were struggling with. So, um, she's kind of behind. And I know my kid is not the only one that's behind as far as learning whichever subject that it is. So I'm trying to make sure that she is straight once she goes back to school, which um, she's excited about. Which by the way, I have not even washed their book bags yet. Normally that's something that I already get done, but with all these birthdays and stuff going on, I haven't even had a chance. So normally I unload that and then just wash their backpacks, which I probably do either this week or next week. So like that I can have everything going and ready to go. Now my husband and I, one thing that we do is we don't wait to the last minute to get the kids school supplies for when school starts. If we have the list or an idea of what the, they will need, we already start getting their school supplies. Now the boys, each one will need a one of those high-tech calculators. We bought one 
for dabbing it was it was used so it's it's toe up from the flow up right now but we they both need calculators and like the basics i think we already have because we buy a lot of the stuff in bulk but everything else we usually start working on their um back to school supply list throughout the summer because y'all do i we don't like it when it all it hits us all at once. <laughs> this is not a good feeling. We already got the supplies for the teachers and everything because of the way we shop little by little so it don't say here. So my husband right. recently checked the mailbox again and we got another set of birthday cards. And this one, it came in a big yellow envelope. And it says, this one's for, it says Devin, but I think you meant David because it was David's birthday. Um, it's this card right here. I thought it was so cute. Happy birthday, Devin, from California. Wishing you a blessed birthday from Shanika and family, June 2021. Thank you. <laughs> yes, <I> thank you. <laughs> and then there's Destiny's card, which I thought was super cute. Uh, one of the Oreo yogurts thing. This card is super, super cute. It says they have a YouTube channel. Their name is was Shane B and Shanika. Sorry, girl. Cause the, it just got wet, so it kind of bit nine. If I messed it up, just let me know. Just leave it in the comments. Your YouTube channel says it right here. As a matter of fact, I'm just gonna put it like this so you guys can see it. Psst. Yes, you can get a yogurt. Read your card, baby girl. It says, "Happy birthday, Destiny from California. Wish you a, a beautiful and blessed birthday. Enjoy your original yogurt. Your." Day. Your day, sweetie. Mm. Okay, From Shanika? Shanika family. And family. Thank you. I just fed the kids dinner and look, they're eating all eating yogurt. Like, I didn't just feed them. I don't want to That's not fair. That was so I didn't just feed them a whole dinner. They still act like they hungry. Very hungry, actually. Oh, yeah? I know I just fed y'all a full meal. They um, still eating. Mom? When does this end? What happened to my yogurt? Your yogurt is fine, and all you gotta do is stir it. <laughs> still good? Mm -hmm. See? It's yogurt. Sometimes it like looks weird. Yeah, I've tasted all those before. Yeah, those are the yogurts from Aldi. I like those. Oh, you should get can you get more? Huh? Can you get more? You want me to get more? From all these? Yeah, I could do that. I guess. Mom, why are some math sheets in there? Math sheets, that's for Destiny to do math sheets tomorrow. What you doing? I put chocolate chips in my mom. Oh, wow. That's a lot. It can never be enough for Devin, huh? <laughs> if you drop a bar, we just eat it. Mm-hmm. Are you guys gonna be full out the end those yogurts? Not really. I'm yeah. ready to play some apples to apples. So from what I remember, there's, there's one card, card that the collar has. Shh. This is my turn. <laughs> party. Oh, 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 Apples to apples is the classic party game that provides <laughs> easy for the four players. The core of the game is simple as pie. Just select the red card from your hand that you think is best described by the green apple card played by the judge. If the judge picks your, picks your card, you win the round. It's as easy as comparing apples to apples. Okay. Make me judge. No, make dad judge. So, so who's the judge? Me. Dad. 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 <laughs> dad. <laughs> I huh? do this by you the judge? I want to be the judge. 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 Dad, can you vote me? <laughs> <laughs> I guess you can vote me. You know what, fine. Let dad be the judge. Vote me. Really? Are you campaigning, David? The word is bright? Hmm. Okay, so we have to pick a word that matches. Okay. You cannot say it, Destiny. Well. Once you can pick your car, you put it face down. Okay. Okay. Let's see, I already picked David's the last one to pick. We're ready on you, David. <laughs> Mine isn't a very good one. Mine isn't either. 
So I got soy milk, a dairy substitute the system of <laughs> soy oil, water, and protein. No others required. <laughs> Let's see. A brain in a jar. Is that what they mean by a think tank? <laughs> I think that. They and this is for the word what? Bright. Uh, oh, that's not bright. Shining. Well, shining basically means bright. Oh, yeah. Yeah. My subconsciousness. Your freedom slip is showing. <laughs> <laughs> Duck Dynasty. <laughs> TV reality show which follows the Robinson's family. Known for their long beards, controversial views. Duck Commander, Duck Commander. <laughs> There we will quack up. <laughs> uh, which card do you think matches that word bright? At least the closest to it. Mm. Do the right thing, Daddy. Do the right thing. Mine. Do the right thing, do the right thing John. <laughs> Remember, you gotta go to sleep with me at night. Ooh. I get this one. No. Is, it's me. It's Is me. that what they mean by no. uh, think tank? It's oh, me. Think it's tank? me. It's You're... me. It's me. So you get to keep no. this. It's me. No. Okay, so the word is catastrophic. Let's see what they have. Let me shuffle it. The first one I got is measles. This highly contagious infection causes mothers to see spots before their eyes. Second word is catfishing. Slang for an activity in which people pretend to be someone they're not using Facebook to create false identities. Third one is political debates. They are political. The rest is debatable. <laughs> and the fourth one is emergency landing. As long as you can walk away, it's a success. <laughs> so let's see which one matches the word cast traffic as much as possible. Do the right thing. <laughs> Do the right thing, mama. Um, I would have to say measles. No! Who got it? I got it, see? We're like this, Wait, mama. Right? I have cat I have political debate. <laughs> so the word now is horrendous. I already put my card down. Daddy, did you put a card down? Mm -mm. Not yet. I think you will. Like <clears throat> How about you, Devin? Not yet. Bam. That's a good bam, one. Bam, 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 bam. That's, right. That's the one. <laughs> right, everybody did? Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead, David. Wait, let me shuffle them up first. Mm -hmm. You missed one. I know. Last and probably least. Okay. Probably like mine. Fringe science. Cybernetic shapes, shape, oh, uh, shape shift, shifters. <laughs> parallel universe. Um, versus mind control. Are you freaked out yet? The long razor. Hi, yo, silver. Why? Wait. <laughs> what was the word again? Hi, yo, silver. Ray. Horrendous. Oh. 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 Mad Max. Former police officer. <clears throat> Turn post apocalyptic, apocalyptic road warrior, and this series filmed films by George Miller, played by both Mel Gibson and Tom Hardy. <laughs> yeah, Tina Turner played in too. They probably don't know who that is. <laughs> who is that? Like in like 83 or 84 when that next came up. Uh, the skin on your elbow. Sean says, it's real. Look at that. Devin did that. Come on, David, do the right thing. Do the right thing. I probably will. Hmm. And the winner is? is? Weenus. Yes! Yeah! 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 Thank you! Thank you! What did you do? What did you do? <laughs> <laughs> I want my card back, sir. I don't want to be back. <laughs> I keep seeing David's giggling. Giggly. So the word is grouchy. I have a good card in there. Me too. Oh yes, I'm sure you do. Oh, yes. This one's a bad card. Why would you put a bad card down? I think it's She's good, destiny, to, it's good to me. It's good to me. You really, John, this ain't dominoes, you know. <laughs> this is not dominoes, Daddy. Number like this six. <laughs> Ostrich form. Mm. Ostrich meat is low in fat and cholesterol, and it tastes like lean beef. 
Maybe. I don't know if anybody brought you, you know. Neck beards. Um. <laughs> this is what happens when you're too hip for a razor. Neck beard. They probably they would put that on the one percent extremely rich people who pay less tax than their secretaries. <laughs> Sanity. A man who is sound of mind and one who keeps the inner madman under lock and key. Oh, that's Devin. Oh, wow. <laughs> mm -hmm. That was Devin. I saw him smiling. Do the right thing, John. Tomorrow. Grouchy. Grouchy. Which one? Come on, John, do it. Please, please, I need the card. Remember? Uh, I go with this because it feel like that. Yeah! Really, John? Yeah, neck beard. <laughs> Your sons are winning. Yeah. Your sons? Uh, whatever. It's my turn now. Dun, 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 dun. Damn it, you gave a green card to mom. <laughs> that green card is oh, guys. Feed him, feed him, mom! Yeah. Hey, Juan, David, it's mom! And so it's between me and David, and David won. Okay, David, I don't understand how you're so happy about this. I don't get it. He doesn't want, he doesn't Next want. Next game. 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 Next I didn't know that you didn't have a good card either. Oh, really? Give me y'all cards. You got lucky on that one, David. We're not using none of the cards we used already. You got lucky on that one, David. He he did a whole victory dance and everything. I don't want mom to win. Oh. That's the only part that You know why I didn't feel that way, you guys? Because I win almost in every game. I beat them in Monopoly. I beat them in all the games. Yeah, they just hate him right now. I'm not looking at him. Mom's the only one I know wants to win. So I just won the second round. Thank you, David. Thank you, hubby. They kept picking me for my cards. <laughs> they hating. They hating. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. And keep a lookout for my next videos, you guys.